the Lake Stamper here in Michigan. How's everybody doing? How's everyone holding up? Well, we finally got the okay to be able to put boats in and boating season's pretty big over here in Michigan. So I thought we would uh, go back to the Sailing Home stamp set and die cut. If you don't have this, this is a great set. It's uh, fantastic to have, especially if you are a water person like me. So we're gonna do a one sheet wonder. We're gonna use the helm and the anchor and the sailboat. I think I'm gonna use the ropes and that's what I'm gonna show you uh, right now. Um, so I already did the helm on this side, all right, to get it started because I didn't want you to have to watch me. And basically putting the helm wherever it looked good, right? Um, the better, the more the better and letting it kind of go off the pages, which is fantastic. Um, and then on this side, let me show you this side, is the, uh, the, the sailboat with the anchors, okay? So I always like to do a two-sheet wonder, because why not, right? And why don't we finish up on here with the rope, okay? And uh, I think that'll be kind of cool. And then we're going to cut this little baby out, and it's going to look darling. And... Okay, so this is the one I want to use. I'm using a blueberry bushel. I thought it was a pretty color. It's bright, um, but not too bright, you know, uh, not neon looking. So um, let's try this out and see how it looks. It doesn't have to be perfect. Remember, we've done these before where they're not perfect, but they kind of, um, kind of join together. Oh, I love it. Don't you love it? I wanted to get some of this already done and then kind of give you an idea of what you could do uh, on your own uh, using uh, about four about four stamps. You don't have to use these in particular, but how cool is that, huh? And just kind of intersperse it where you know wherever you think it needs to be uh, put on, and also let it go off the page. Maybe do a second generation of the stamp. Um, cool. So, I started a new blog, and I'm very excited. I'll have the link for you, uh, so you can check it out. And if you want to subscribe, that would be great. I'm doing uh, some grand prizes and fun stuff like that. So, uh, please join up. And um, I'm kind of excited. I worked real hard on it. I had some time. Obviously, we had time on our hands. So I thought I'd take a refresher course and learn how to do some stuff that I had, I knew how to do a while back, but had kind of forgotten. So I'm kind of excited about it. So I hope you uh, join me, okay? Uh, I think it'd be a lot of fun. And look, look how fast that was. Oh my gosh, quick, huh? So in fact, let's just put a couple more on here. This kind of one area right here. And let's just do one more area. Oh, I like that. I like it. Like it. Yes. It's so good. It kind of gets out your frustrations. <laughs> Not that we have any, right? <laughs> oh, I kill me. All right, so let me go cut this, all right? And then double check. We've got this side too. Now this side doesn't have as much. And maybe before we cut, let's just do a couple more. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's add the rope on this one too. Why not? It looks a little bit uh, open with the white. And I actually like to have a lot more items in it. So maybe having this rope in there will do the trick because um, I do want them to kind of be connected in a little bit, in a little way. What do you think? What do you think? Oh, wow. This is looking really nice. You can use any of the blues. There's a Pacific Point you could use or a Seaside Spray. Uh, that might be a nice one. Um, look at that. That is so cool. <laughs> you know what? Another thing, especially that little, all the colors. This is the same color, uh, which is the... Uh, what blueberry bushel, but it just so happened it might have been lighter when I uh, stamped it, and it came out pretty cool. And one's darker, you know. I think that comes comes out really kind of neat. Um, and 
then before you know it, what do we have? Our own wallpaper again. <laughs> All right, now this reminds me of summer. Oh my gosh, yes. That's nice. My biggest boat is a Sweetwater 24 footer. Um, one of my favorite uh, pontoon boats that I've had. Now see, nice. This is only has two stamps and then this one has three. I don't know which one I like better. So let's cut this up, okay? All right, I'll be right so back. So we cut the first uh, part of this card at five and a quarter times four. And I like both sides, but I think I'm gonna use the helm side first. And then the second part of the ca uh, card that I cut, I cut it at uh, five times three and three quarters. And again, uh, I kind of like this side, so I'm going to pop that up like this. Um, now I've done some other cards using the Memory More card pack, and they came out so so pretty. I mean, they're so. This is the laser cut one, and uh, I thought it was so pretty with the lighthouse, and uh, I love the same. And it's just a really pretty, pretty card, you know, uh, with the lighthouse, which is my favorite. So now uh, we're gonna use the Memory More card pack. The stickers makes it so simple, right? Also look in your, you know, look in your junk pile where you might've kept some stuff. That's what I did. I'm like, oh, I had done some stuff. I'm, I got it already ready. Let's use it. You, it needs a home, right? <laughs> so let's uh, first get this one down and I will glue this one. This is our first our first layer. Easy card to do and you made it yourself really. And then just kind of um, add your memory more card pack if you have that and you've got a really quick card and you really literally made it yourself. So I'm going to use like I said the anchors on this side. Let's uh, pop yeah, that I just up. did the dimensionals and I just popped it up. That looks terrific. Now, uh, to make this a quick card and not have to do a lot, is use the Memories and More card pack. I think they are fun to use, easy, they make it so easy. Um, we're, obviously there's a whole bunch of different one, different, different designs, um, and you can use whatever, you know, it's, it's great to use. It just really adds a little dimension to your cards and makes it so fast. So we're just going to Put some more dimensionals on because why not <laughs> and we're just gonna pop this little baby up I'm not gonna do too much on this card I don't think it really needs to be done I just think the saying is gonna really take uh, the, take center stage you know um, sometimes that's all you need um, I have a friend of mine that works in the grocery business and I'm gonna send her off a card because I'm thinking of her right now uh, a lot of people that I, I know uh, that are essential workers that definitely need a little TLC. Um, okay, that is pretty cool, huh? <laughs> okay, now um, I am going to... I had this already popped up and ready, right? I'm like, I'm not going to waste this. I'm going to take this. I already had stamped it. And I had already done the die cuts of this, and it comes, this whole set comes with that die cut. I'm going to pop that up right there. Isn't that darling? I know, right? <laughs> A nice, simple card. It doesn't have to be outrageous. Sometimes, sometimes the simple cards are the so, best. So, let's stamp. Um, and, and before I do that, I'm going to take this one that's all white. Um, and I'm going to just kind of use that, uh, go back to my Pacific, I'm sorry, my blueberry bushel. And let's get a dauber and let's kind of just uh, lightly, not real heavy now, let's just do a light daubing of that, okay? I just want to see how it's going to look. doesn't have to be. Whenever, I, whenever I'm using the white, I just don't want it to be an all white sentiment. Unless it's a real white card and that's what I'm trying to do. I'd like a little bit of, um, I don't want it to be so stark, you know? Now, it doesn't really matter what the middle looks like because I'm not going to use that part. It's going to be covered. But let's definitely get the edges of this. 
and just kind of, you know, kind of give it that antique kind of look. And that can be a little bit darker. Perfect. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Don't go crazy on you, on yourself, okay? Um, oh, yeah. That looks great. Okay, so here's my little thing. That's perfect. Love it. Oh, my gosh, that looks good. So let's do... Let's do one here. And let's do... One here. Okay. That looks perfect. I love that it's up high, too, right? Um, the other thing we can do is add... We can either add a boat <laughs> or let's add another anchor. That's an idea. Love that because it's so simple, right? And we'll add it right here. Look how cute that is. And I'd like to do some pearls. I usually do rhinestones, but um, A, I can't find them. And B, I think we could do some, um, <laughs> I know I'm, I'm, I'm hilarious today. I'm going to put the, uh, the pearls right on the anchor. I think that looks kind of cool, actually. There we go. Oh, that's darling. Love that. That's so cute. See? It's just a nice, simple card. It doesn't have to be, oh my God, outrageous, you know? Now this one, I'm going to do this okay, thing. Okay, let's see. Oh, nice. Oh, that's so pretty. I did have a bow, but I don't think we're gonna need it. Um, just a thought. Let's see if I like it or not. Um, adds a little bit of, you know, I'll think about that. Let's see, what do you think? Do you like the bow or not? Um, I can always take that off, uh, but I'll play around with that. But I love that, I think it came out nice. Now, let's get our handy dandy. Now I use the uh, navy. This is in the neutral uh, pack, okay? And then I've got some leftover to make some more cards. Always uh, cut yourself some five and a quarter times four uh, paper stock, Whisper White. Have it already ready for the inside of your card so you remember to finish the card. Because what happens is we make the, we make it and we never go inside and finish it and then we never use the card, right? We got We got to finish the card so we use it. Um, just my little two cents. Now, we cut that extra piece when we cut these down, and this is what we had left. So, I'm thinking we could do either this way or this way. I mean, they're so, so pretty. Um, I'm thinking this might be kind of cool. You know, it looks kind of like the, the helm just keeps going, so... That didn't take but a few seconds. And then we're just going to put this right on. And see, we've got these already ready. And then we can decide what to uh, put in. Perfect. Well, that was a fun card. And look how easy that was to make. That was so, so easy. Just get yourself a nice whisper white. Start uh, doing this fun, fun. I mean, just go all over and start making your little wallpaper. And before you know it, you have made your own designer paper again. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you have a great day and stay out of trouble, all right? All right, chat soon. Bye-bye. Be safe.